Hi guys. Hi guys. So we want you to subscribe to our adventures. Yeah. <laughs>supposed to meet and they're a big restaurant on board and then they call you by groups and then you leave. purchase all-inclusive amber beach club getaway it does come with a dominican buffet and drinks and then inside a beach and there's volleyball and all kinds of things so it was a little chaotic getting here <laughs> but i think we're to the right well, we're, spot we're at least in the right group we're just waiting for our ride and then we can relax and normally Amber Cove, if you don't want to do an excursion, they do have uh, a really large pool, zip line, uh, food. Water slides. Yeah, yeah, they do have all that here. Hopefully, uh, we'll have enough time after the excursion so we can uh, re-show you that. Yeah, it was our sec. This is our second time here. The first time we just did all the free pool stuff and uh, food and drink and all that. This time we thought we'd do a little different, just do an excursion. So. Come along. It All right, we're here. Welcome drink. Time. Welcome drink station. Hola. Who doesn't like a welcome drink? Hola. 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 Boom. A little welcome drink. 
Ah. It tastes exactly like fruit punch. Fruit punch. Is there anything in here? No, I think it's just fruit punch. <laughs> but I'm thirsty. All right, figure out where to go. Okay, so we found ourselves a spot. They'll actually bring drinks to you and you just order what you want. So I just asked for a traditional rum punch. Looks very good. Cheers. And it was brought up by Leo Leo DiCaprio. <laughs> and look at all the fruit in there. Yeah. It's loaded with fruit on top. And they it also like a little pineapple in their drink. Yeah, they have pina coladas, they have all kinds of drinks. So Ooh. Oh, and then he said the local beer, El Presidente, is very good. But although it does look like a very, very rough sea day, so this might strictly be relaxing, eating, and drinking. And he said the buffet is open during the whole time, so anytime you want to go up to the buffet, it's Dominican cuisine, uh, rice, beans, we'll show it to you. All right, I got to say the service is excellent. Uh, so this is Nikki right here. She's going to be one of our servers. And then there was Leo. And then just bring, they keep coming by to see what you need and they'll bring in for you. So service, awesome. Uh, we may actually just, yeah, it's 1230. We may ch go check out the buffet because it is lunchtime actually. Ooh. All right. Cool. Thank you. Yes. No, 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 You have to wait. Oh, we got to wait. There, okay. You wait for that shot. Oh, 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 okay. Yes, yeah. Andy. Andy. Oh, say boy. salut. Okay, salut. Cheers. cheers salut. to Melvin. Cheers. <laughs> okay. Yes. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> hey, that's good. That's rum, right? That's, yeah. Cherry that opens rum. everything up. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, good. Melvin. Yes. Thanks, Melvin. Yes. All right, he's the man. <laughs> oh, my God. I was not prepared to take a shot. All right, well, these look lovely. All right, that was like cherry rum. All right, that was a little nuts, that cherry rum. That was good. All right, have you tried this little drink? I haven't, but I, I think kind I'm gonna- Kind of like applesauce on top. Take a, that can't uh, be applesauce. I'm gonna take a drink from the glass because it does look like there's got, like a sugar coating. Yeah, something on the rim. Just don't put an eye out. Oh. Good? All right. Melvin Special is the way to go. Melvin Special. Yeah. For sure. We have a cool little buffet area. Oh, look at this chicken. We gotta find a plate. Pasta bolognese. I see rice and oh. Ooh, potato croquettes. Potato croquettes, wow. Oh, very nice. Ooh. Oh, potato salad. Okay, we just got our plates. This food looks fantastic. So, potato, macaroni, ripe bananas, fish. No, fish, oh, rice, rice with oh, vegetables. potato croquette. Yes, potato croquette. Yeah, this looks really good. Holy cow, look at all this. Dominican food. Uh, he recommended the fish finger. And with the sauce right here, I'm gonna just try this real quick. That's good. All right, bon appetit. What have you tried? So far, the rice. The rice, good <laughs> stuff so far. Yeah. Ziggy zaggy, ziggy zaggy, oi oi oi. Oh, ziggy zaggy, ziggy zaggy, oi oi oi. Lemon drop. Lemon, lemon drop. drop. <laughs> Cheers, guys. Cheers. Cheers. Salute, salute, Cheers. salute. salute. Oh. Right. To Melvin. Thank you, Melvin. To Melvin. Thank you. We're gonna go back to the beach now. Oh, that's good. Ah. <laughs> okay, so lunch is done. We have to say some of the best food ten we've had. Ten out of ten. I ate almost everything on my plate, so everything I picked, I liked. I didn't have any complaints. It was all hot tasted good and they said it was all local dominican food and you know fantastic we've had food at like a bunch of different resorts this may be one of the best yeah probably the best so do this excursion oh we didn't check out the desserts yeah great great place they got a bar here and the staff is just lights out lights out staff and our 
there's plenty of seating. So other resorts too, we have had trouble finding a place to sit once yeah. we have food, but there's there's plenty and you can bring it to your beach chair as well if you didn't want to sit at a table. Yeah, and pretty much every spot has an umbrella. Pretty much every spot. And then over here they have beach volleyball. No one's playing yet, but oh, check and it out. They also do have lockers right over here, so it's first come, first serve. So if you need to put stuff in the locker, they do have that as well. Too. Oh, and there's even a gift shop over there. Yep. Yeah, I have to check out the gift shop. And they have lockers, yep, changing area. They have a Melvin. <laughs> that's where they keep their Melvins. <laughs> that's where they keep the Melvins. Look at this view over here. Whoa. Oh, it looks a little calmer over here too. Yeah, it does. Oh, nice. I will say time is sure flying though. When they said we only had three hours, I was like, oh, okay, wow, we only got three hours, but. <laughs> oh, look at this. Ooh, Will my that's shoes a view. Be safe? Nope, nope, I gotta go up further. <laughs> okay, the water temperature is pretty good. Oh, all right. Yeah, I could get in. It's cool, but it's not cold. Oh, beautiful. Look at this. Ooh. Look at this. There's the man, Melvin. This is where they keep their dancing Melvin to Nikki. And Nikki. Juts out all the mountains. I mean, this beach is just really cool. And an MSC ship is right there. <laughs> it's the Cupid Shore. Andrew just did Macarena. It's Watch out for Melvin, he keeps bringing these. <laughs> Remember my name? Yeah. 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 Yeah
Yeah. Okay, so our excursion you just saw was awesome. Uh, we give it five out of five stars. Yes. And we'll put the little link in the description. But it was a carnival excursion, uh, but real good. So. Yep. So we had Nikki, Melvin, Leo. Watch out for Melvin. <laughs> I think that was yeah. I think we got everybody. But yeah, so we can't recommend this one enough. So definitely do this excursion. Service exceptional and uh, food outstanding. Yep. And look at that. Nothing to see. <sighs> okay, so the steps are something, but the view is getting better and better. Look at the view here. We're at the top of the sky view bar. And it has fantastic views. So apparently two more months, she's going to dry dock. She'll get the paint job and whatever other refurbishments. Sky view bar, we've had this before. We're a little too full now. All right, there goes the Caribbean princess. So we were too late for the sail away, but there's a little bit of it. There's your sail away. There. There's your sail away. <laughs> <laughs> This one uh, an eight at least, maybe eight or nine. It's hard to say. So you got that one hearts on fire. Creamy, creamy. To me, I can taste the gin, so I think I'm gonna have to go with go the hearts on fire. Yeah. Uh, perfect storm. Perfect storm. All right, perfect storm. 
That's really good. Normally, that's we've had that like in a wine glass, and they used to do like a, a little storm or like smoke or something. But it tastes really good. Actually, I'm gonna just say, yeah, nine on Perfect Storm, eight and a half on Hearts on Fire. I'm gonna say seven just because I don't like it. And what was yours? On I'm one? also gonna give that a nine. A nine. All right, these are two winners. Okay, French kiss. French kiss and youthful and bold. Oh, sorry. Youthful and bold baritini. All right, youthful and bold baritini. Yes. And then the French kiss. What's the time? Time. Yes. Oh. You don't have time for time. All right. Oh. Don't forget to cheer. All right. Oh, that's different. That one is very nice. All right, well, that's a yeah. dry champagne, but it's good. Yeah, you would like that. And then that. it's got the little uh, a bit of oh, flavors, raspberry. The chambord, raspberry. And so that's a bit dry. Let's see what you think of it. It smells dry. Mm. So I think I prefer youthful and bold. It is a little on the sweet side, but I would still maybe give that one at least an eight, maybe. It's sweet. I would maybe give But the French kiss is very dry. I would maybe say, uh, maybe a six on that one. I'm gonna go way down. I'm gonna give that a three, just cause a I don't three. like, I don't like oh. champagne. champagne. I don't like champagne. She don't like champagne. Blueberry vodka. Oh, blueberry. That's the taste. Blueberry. Yes, blueberry. Oh, I love blueberries. If I add blueberries, I'll put some blueberries in there. Alright, we're all, the audience is waiting. So I think I will, I will give it an eight. <laughs> an eight? Alright, yeah. okay. Well, that one's a winner, but it's also sweet. Not yeah. really sweet. But, alright. And hey, friends. <laughs> And one of our favorite drinks here, sparkling water. Yep. Thank you, Anna. It's the bubbles, right? Yeah. Very lovely. Yes. <laughs> This is the barbecue beef spring rolls. And then I got a Hawaiian shrimp hokey bowl. I'm really excited to try this out because this looks. I've never seen that. That looks fantastic. It's like brand new. So this is the rice here, and then everything else is basically like oh. the inside of like. So it's like a deconstructed sushi roll. All right. You got to tell us about yeah. that one. So I have broccoli cheese soup, which is, this is really good. And of course, you know, I gotta get shrimp cocktail. I mean, I always love that. All right, I would've got two of those. <laughs> two, really good? Oh, uh, we haven't seen that on the menu before. I like before. poke bowls though. So yeah, that was really good. All right, so we think that's a new item. So the spring roll had a lot of crunch, so I thought it was gonna be a good contender. But the meat is a little chewy, but it has good flavor. Well, there it goes. But uh, I definitely would pick the uh, poke bowl over the spring rolls. So it's not the chi bang spring rolls? Okay. Dinners have arrived. Pasta carbonara. Spaghetti carbonara. Spaghetti carbonara. Look how crispy the bacon is. Yeah. And I already did take a little taste of it, and it's pretty good. So this is kind of my go-to when it's on the menu. There you go. And for the first time, I've tried the upcharge. So it is surf and turf upcharge. It's like $23 extra. Uh, but it looks really good. I will check back with you and show you how this is. 
surf and turf in the main dining room. So instead of like $48 of charge for uh, the Fahrenheit Steakhouse, it's $23. So that's a pretty good deal. So we'll see how it is though. It looks fabulous. Okay, so real quick, the surf and turf, very, very good. Filet's good, lobster, really on point. Everything's good. So I think that's worth $20 of charge. Very good. And Andrea's has crispy bacon, and that's good. Bada boom. All right, so we're already full. The second the entrees went away, these so, immediately set. I'm not sure if I've ever had banana, uh, cream, banana pie. cream pie before, but it looks delightful. Okay. Yeah, I had the same thing. Okay, so I'm pretty sure banana cream pie is new on the menu. This is fantastic. And then it's got uh, salted caramel drizzled on top. Yeah, I, I don't remember it ever being on the menu, so no, but I'm very it's got to be a new now. item. I don't know if I can finish it. <laughs> All right, so good main dining room night, but of course I had an upcharge. Whew, all right. Whew. Day three is complete. Woke up very tired this morning. I have not been sleeping so great or air conditioning. I don't know if you can hear right now, but it is super loud. Um, and Andy and I, before we go to bed, we have to watch. We always have the TV on just because we have to have some sort of noise. And then the TV is extremely bright. So it's like daytime. I don't know. I, I don't, the bed seems to be comfortable. I just can't seem to sleep and then I'm just exhausted the whole rest of the day. Um, but went to Amber Cove. Uh, it was Amber Cove Beach Club all inclusive and it was fantastic. If we ever come back to Amber Cove, I think we would definitely do that excursion again. 20 minute um, bus ride. We got loungers, an umbrella right on the water and met a lot of friends on there. So shout out to Detroit and uh, Savannah, Georgia. You know who you are. It was fantastic meeting everybody. Uh, staff on the beach was excellent. We had Melvin, we had Nikki, we had Leo. Uh, food was amazing. It was Dominican uh, Republic flavor food. So uh, it was a good time. We left full, had plenty of different rums, cocktails, all sorts of stuff. So once again, exhausted went to the main dining room for dinner and he got the surf and turf as an upcharge he said it was fantastic all of my food was great but we are tired it is just after 10 o'clock and we are ready for bed so we'll see what day four is we go to grand turk that is our first time going to that port so we're excited tell you all about that tomorrow so for now bad time <laughs>